A recent conversation with a collector is the basis of today's video. We happen to be talking about uh, error stamps and how we both seem to gravitate to those kind of stamp varieties. While we were uh, discussing the topic in general, we came upon the topic of how to value stamps with no gum. This was uh, specific to stamps that were issued with gum but were never postally used. For example, they were never sent through the mail or have any cancellations on them, but they have no gum on the back side of the stamp. Now that could be for many reasons. It could be that they were in an old album and the stamp became stuck to an album page, probably due to humid uh, climates, and they had to be soaked off. Um, in any case, he specifically asked about a stamp from Peru, which was uh, Scott number 222A, uh, a great stamp. I'll bring that up right now. Um, this stamp is greatly undervalued. Now, Easy Stamp does not provide values for stamps with no gum unless they were specifically issued with no gum. In this case, this stamp should have original gum on the back to be valued as mint hinged or mint never hinged. So, how do we enter this stamp and how do we value it? Well, clearly, it cannot be entered as a used stamp. Easy Stamp is designed to be very extensible to allow you to handle almost any kind of stamp. All we need to do is create a new grade called MNG or Mint No Gum and then decide whether we want to derive a value from one of the other grades. Now personally, I do not derive values from other grades, but this collector felt in general that uh, Mint No Gum stamps are valued at about a third of the uh, Mint Hinged value. So let's set this up uh, using the grades editor. Now, as I said, I'm using the current uh, uh, 2018 Peru database. So first thing we do is we go to the utility menu, click on grades configuration. And what we want to do is we want to add a mint no gum uh, grade. So we click on the plus sign and we're going to copy everything. So we're going to give it our short form of MNG, give it a description of mint no gum and then we said we were going to derive this from the mint hinged very fine value and we feel that it's worth 33 percent of that uh, that particular grade and as you can see there it is down at the bottom what i'm going to do is move it up to the top so that it's easily visible when we go to enter our stamps in the uh, in the grades area and then click the green check mark to save it so let's bring up 222A again. And there it is with our, uh, oops, where's our mint no gum? There it is right there. I missed it. So let's inventory it as such. I'm going to get rid of the mint hinged. And we'll save it. So there's our stamp um, inventoried as mint no gum and the value we assigned to it was one-third of the mint hinged very fine value. Now let's uh, run a quick line item report to uh, to see that stamp. Whoops, we have to reset this. And there's the stamp that we just entered as mint no gum. I hope this video helps others who have other grade types to inventory in their collections such as space fillers, forgeries, cancel to order, etc. Now please note that we are releasing the 2018 edition of Easy Stamp in a few days uh, with some great new features not found in any other software. Now we will announce the 2018 version in the coming days. Enjoy and happy holidays to everyone.